President Buhari don't set to go along with a population deal. And Kano government won't put Alamadri children for inside school. Falana don't write letter give Minister of Justice to release Shawari. Since people don't die, a stroke for inside Ijebu for Mushi crushed them for women's state. Good afternoon and welcome to Azobia Max TV. This is now as it take happen. My name is Adati Hongkwe. For inside the first story where we carry come, we the year now say except for last minute change, President Mama Dubuari go go along with the 2020 appropriation bill on Tuesday. And as the matter be, we see here the presidency being invited the leadership of the National Assembly for the budget signing ceremony will happen for inside the presidential villa. And as matters still be, Senate President Ahmed Lawan and the Speaker of House of Representatives, Femi Pajabi Amila, with other people, now been there there to witness the signing of the budget. Our Wazobia Max TV to person John Emmanuel, he did there now for inside the streets of Abuja, and he won't find out waiting people they think about January December budget cycle. John Emmanuel. Okay, you go just uh, give us story of uh, waiting and waiting people they think about the January to December budget cycle. You know, say before Martino, you know, say before the advent of the uh, this fort, uh, when democracy coming, we the idea of budget usually now say budget is supposed to strong from January to December, but along the line, uh, so many things going to happen for our political system where we say people kind of wonder why we say budget. This is what they go pass on for January, usually now from December to January. The budget will come, come around May, June. And then people don't even feel know how to give account. People they like to tell God, ask God and say, may let me give account of how they carry spend money. So now the plan where we say they want to begin to implement the budget from January to December. Now we want open get plan where we say people they celebrate. We don't talk to so many people where we say they talk say the thing makes sense so much so that people fit understand how government carry spend money, how carry how government carry budget the money, how the money carry spend, and then they will fit more whether uh, Mago Mago did for inside the team. I then here with one of our senior guy here where we say he too he get experience for matter of budget and he won't tell us how the team carry sweet and for belly. Uh, okay, tell us about this implementation of budget where it will happen from January to December. Well, um, okay, it's a, it's a good development, a good development in the sense that it gives some specific timelines for execution of the budget. In other words, it gives definite budget cycles. But Nigeria basically is not the budget cycles. Businesses run different budget cycles. Some can start from February and end in another February or can start from June and the next year June. It depends on your cycle. What is most important is the implementation. If the implementation is not judiciously done and followed and monitored, and the government apparatuses and agencies that are responsible to track and monitor budgets do not do their work, the starting from January to December may not solve any problem. All right. Uh, now the voice of uh, okay, your name again, uh, Oliver. Now the voice of Oliver will just hear so, and he does tell us how. What is according to him now? Uh, it no matter. Probably you go matter if at all. The main thing is to make them judiciously. That means say no government use the money, make people feel the impact of the money. So even if government wants that budget from December to another December or from. Uh, September, the, but the whole budget is a make people feel, feel the impact of the budget. So now, so we can see I'm from Federal Secretary all day. They talk to people. Ada? Hello?
Welcome back on top as it take happen for Inside Wazobia Max TV. On top the first second story where they hand, the chief of naval staff that now Vice Admiral Ibok Eteibas, he don't come out now con the yard, they give naval personnel them. They make them not do anything where they say you spoil the name of the service as they do their work on top this festive period. He and this one now for inside the weekend for the fourth quarter of a 10 kilometer road march exercise where they say them do to organize as they organize them to mark the end of the year. Now, the Navy Chief of Policy and Plan, that's now Rear Admiral Begri Ibe, eh, oh, now he show face for him for there. And he can the Yana talk, say Navy, they protect any to where they say consign maritime, and say they see they contribute on top of the Gulf Guni maritime security arrangement, plus including many other things that where they say them they do. And still as TB, Rear Admiral Ibe won stick on the remember fallen heroes of Nigeria as them die as they fight to protect the country people. On top of the next story where we see carry come, before military head of state, that's now retired General Ibrahim Babangida, he don't come out now come here and say, he they very cajado saying they are life and in the bubble. Now in talk person, Kasim Afebua, now he and this one for inside the talk paper where him carry come out on Sunday. Him they condemn the report now where B say they carry fake news, say the retired Major General don't die. And as he come out, come they and this one, he talks say, he gets hope now, say the new law where be say they for National Assembly on top of social media matter, say he go help to tackle matter of fake news for the country. Retired General Babangida where be say clock 78 years for inside August. Now before military president between August 27, 1985 and August 26, 1993. We shall probably enter the next story where we carry come. On top of a bad road and bad attitude of uh, drivers, on top of traffic rules, now be one of the causes of the bad hold up where we say they happen for inside Lagos. And to manage this traffic matter now, Lagos state government don't come out now, they give assurance to Lagos state people, say as the matter be, then go expand the road now to make this traffic wahala so that it go be very easy for them, especially on top of this festive period. Our Wazobia Max TV story person, that's now Maureen Ogolo, he go join us now from Alausa to give us story on top of the things where we say the state government don't do to make sure they then keep their promise. Hello, Maureen. Hello. Okay. Josh Apali, well done. Tell us what thing they happen and how far the state government for inside Lagos don't go to make sure they then keep this their promise. Thank you very much, Maureen Ogolo. Who oh, sharply come out from that story enter the next one where we carry come. For the next story, human rights lawyer that na Femi Falana, he don't write a letter give the Attorney General of the Federation and the Minister of Justice that na Abubakar Malami make them for release of Moya Lishore from DSS. Follow that letter where him write for inside December 13, 2019, give to read people on Sunday. If they follow the announcement now where we say the AGF be made on Friday, saying don't take over the case of Olawale Bakery and Omoyele 
Shoeri from DSS. Ogafala na tell Malami say it ain't necessary say him write this letter. As the two lawyers will be the say, say them send go DSS headquarters for the release of Shoeri, say make them go meet Malami. And we sharply go inside the next story. The Ogun State Police Command now on Sunday don't come out to come talk. Say they don't arrest three members of one bad gang like that. Take off said MT from patients where they inside hospital, where they for or Malaja for inside Odumbaku Street, for inside Oremeji Ibafo for Obafemi Awode local government area of the state. The state talk person that's na Bimbola Oyeyemi, na he am this one for inside the talk paper for inside Abiokuta. Oyeyemi talk say as the matter be say the suspect them now na for Larry Aziz where be say they 25 years old. Tell me talk pe Bola Rinwa where they 24 years and the Kola De Ahmed where they 30. Say they enter the hospital now on December 7, 2019. Can't rob the patients them. She could take on talks as the matter be said and catch them for inside Shimawa area of the state and say them recover like 12 different types of Android and iPhones, plus including wristwatches, where it be said they can't let her give the owners for inside there. And for the next one, for Tori, where be say no sweets for Bele at all at all. We hear say six people now nine die, plus in, and these six people now including children and adults are struck now for inside Ijebu for Mushin for Ijebu East local government area of Ogun State being crushed them. According to the talk person of Traffic Road and Enforcement Compliance Court, that's now Trace. He named na Baba Tunde Akinbi. He talks say na bad overtaking we keke rider do na he cause this accident so. He see can say they don't carry the dead body of the people go private mortuary for the town. And like, as people where they vex now on top of this matter, can set the truck on fire, still carry the driver, go for Itamogiri police station for more torch lighting. And for inside the next story, the governor, the Kano state government now don't come out to contact say, as the matter be, say they don't finish plan now to put the Almajiri children, where which over 40% of school children for inside northern Nigeria, carry and tell, give them formal basic education. The state governor, Abdullah Higanduje Nanyan, this one, for the three-day retreat where B.C. then do for inside weekend for Kaduna State. For the members of the state executive council, he said the children now where B.C. then no day school, say they plenty where for inside Kano. And as sake of say other children now from other states, they enter Kano, since where B.C. government declare free education. In say out of school children now will still continue to enjoy the free education policy of the state government from primary school to secondary school level. And for inside another Tory, Borno state government don't bring out plans now to provide permanent shelter. That's a better house where we say people for inside Bama, for inside the Konda, Konduga local council of the state. Where we say they don't get where to stay. That's a place where we say they go to stay for now. About 750 families now we hear say go benefit from this one. The governor and the, the state governor, Baba Gana Umar Zulum talk say the goal now to provide permanent shelter as they go remodel the villages now where BC they don't abandon. And this one now to fight matter where BC consign hunger, where security matter costs for inside the country. The government talks say them don't they share food and there's some kind of item now give these IDP people. That's now people where BC they don't get where to stay. One of the people now where BC benefit from inside this one, when they talk say before, say then before now, say they no fit to work for inside their farm. Sake of the plenty Boko Haram Wahala we did there. And we shall probably come up from inside that to re-enter for Senate. The Senate now don't start legislative action to remove the law where we say no favor women for inside police force. The bill where we say pass second reading on Thursday, now Imo East Senator, that's now Onye Uchi is in one, now sponsored this one. And this bill now won't make them create equal rights for police workers them. Senator is in one talks is some of the things where we say no favor female police officer. Now then they apply for permission now to go marry as then they see go, they touch light their husband to be to check if he gets any criminal record. In consider they talk, say single police women now go spend three years for service before they go fit apply for the permission to marry. And the Police Act Cap P19, Laws of the Federation of Nigeria 2004, by expunging the gender discriminatory provisions of the regulations 122, 123, 124, and 127. Essentially, this bill 
seeks to expunge the provisions of regulation 122, 123, 124, and 127 from the principal act for the following reasons. One, regulation 122 restricts female police officers assigned to the general duty branch of the MPF to telephone clerical and office orderly duties. B, regulation 123 prohibits women police from drilling on the arms. C, regulation 124 mandates female police officers to apply for permission to marry, while the intending fiancé is also investigated for criminal records. Since a male police officer is not subjected to the same inhibitions, the current regulations are inconsistent <laughs> with sections 42 of the Constitution and Article 2 of the African Charter of Human and People's Rights, which have prohibited discrimination on the basis of sex. There is therefore a need to expunge the above regulations, and it is not reasonably justifiable in a democratic state like Nigeria, which has domesticated the African Charter on Human and People's Rights and ratified the protocol to the African Charter on Human and People's Rights on the rights of women in Africa and the Convention on the Elimination of All Forms of Discrimination Against Women. Still on top of the matter, Senator Eninaya Baribe, Stella Odua and Rocha Sokorocha, where they say they're not grief for waiting there for inside the police law book. They still put mouth on top of the matter. I fully support this uh, bill, that we can amend this law so that we can give dignity to our female folk and to also ensure that what a man can do, a woman can also do it. It's uh, very strange to find such provisions in the uh, Police Act, which is discriminatory in the sense that the male counterparts don't have the same restrictions. A male counterpart can marry a criminal. Nobody will go to check whether the, the woman he wants to marry is a criminal or not. A male counterpart does not need to write to ask for permission. And, you know, such manners of those type of things. And, of course, the question of not being able to bear arms and all that. And if you check today, you will find that in the detective cadre in the police, there's no woman there. Because they restrict them all to... And it doesn't mean that they don't have the same brains like we as men do have. It's not peculiar to police. All agencies, all law enforcement agencies, and globally, in UK, in all European countries, the best law enforcement um, personnel are female because they've, they've been trained to do so. But we are not doing that in Nigeria, and I think it's not fair. And so when I use the word not fair, it's not even strong enough. It's not human to do what we are currently doing to these people. How can you say that a woman should take permission before she gets pregnant? It's about being fair to all, and women in particular. We are 70% of this population. Why are we being treated this way? It's totally unfair. Thank you, Constitutional Review. I think this high time will take the bull by the horns and revisit some of these primitive laws that have been made that have kept our nation in bondage of some sort and take a decisive decision to get rid of it and give us a constitution that will make us more progressive and more modern in our, in our lives. So I, I support this uh, bill and the move for a constitutional review. As they see the yarn on top, the matter when they put mouth finish. Senate President Ahmed Lawan Kong talks in no be only for inside police force now they go do this one, but may they still carry them enter military and paramilitary agencies them. I'll read a second time. Say aye. Those against say nay. Aye, sir. Black will be part of our laws. But I will also encourage us to look back into the other services the immigration, the prison service, and other uh, similar paramilitary agencies to find out if this kind of obnoxious systemic discrimination against women are there so that we are able to, to deal with them uh, expeditiously. 
My people, will you come back with business and sports story? No go anywhere. <music> For inside business, Ubongi government now don't come out when they draw hand for a year plus, including bit hand for chess, they promise say then go disconnect Niger Republic and the Togo power supply. That one I say they no go give them light if they no pay their money where BC don't reach like 16 million dollars. As a matter being the managing director of transmission company of Nigeria, Usman Mohammed, now he and this one, he say the one where BC they owe before, say high reach 100 million dollars. And that one has inside business now in day. We they come back again with sports. No go anywhere. <music> For inside sports, the panel where we say the Federation of Nigeria arranged now to touch light their president of Athletic Federation of Nigeria, that's Nashehu Ibrahim Gusel. It did not give until Wednesday now to appear before the panel where we say they touch light in matter, sake of the money where we say borrow leg, and saying break the law where we say is still there for inside the law book of the AFN. For inside the December 13, 2019 letter where Olu Wale Afolabi, chairman of the investigative panel, been signed. Them talks they make Guzal show face by 10 o'clock for morning for the AFM boardroom where they for MKO Abiola National Stadium for inside Abuja. And they make him carry all the paper then where he say he go show how he take use the 92 million naira where he say collect from government for some of the championship where he say he hold between 2017 and 2019. Now all the to read them be this as it take happen. But before we go, make we still look all our top to read them again for this afternoon. <music> President Buhari don't set to go along with 2020 appropriation bill. Can the government now want put Alamadri children for inside school? Falana don't write a letter give Minister of Justice to release Shawari. And six people, nine don't die, as struck for inside the Jebu machine, crush them for open state. My people now all the to read them with this, as it take happen. My name now Adati Omuku. Good afternoon. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.